everyone, and welcome back to Good Omens. Today is Season 1, Episode 3, and after this episode, we're all already halfway done with Season 1. What the heck? <laughs> the sixth episode is so short. What the... F so short. Um, last time, they finally found Adam. Well, Ezra Fell found Adam through the phone, but we haven't reached them yet. Um, so, and the Horsemen of War is out. <laughs> out like it's a series um the horseman of war is like causing mayhem and chaos um so there's that and uh yeah yeah <laughs> no that's it um there's really nothing else i mean a lot of stuff happened but that's like the the important things for next episode that like i that could be a thing that um yeah it's been really fun. I'm having so much fun. Uh, this is really great. I love the, the comedy in this show. Amazing. Um, and the way that it mixes comedy and but still like keeping the story going not just being like focused on comedy too much. So that's really nice. I think that's it. So let's just start the video. Oh, we're back in the Garden of Eden? Oh. Aziraphale, oh. angel of the eastern gate. Yes, Where is the flaming sword I gave you, Aziraphale? <laughs> the gate of Eden. Sword? Right. Um, uh, big, sharp, cutty thing. Yes. I uh, gave it away. I get my own head next. You're already yeah. gone? Mesopotamia. Be. Why are we suddenly back in time? Hey, Crowley. It's about build a big boat and fill it with the traveling zoo. Oh, from what I hear, Noah gone's a bit tetchy, wiping out the human race. Oh, that's nice. Ooh. I know what I know about this, but Noah up there. Yeah, Noah. His family, his sons, their wives, they're all going to be fine. But the rest? But they're drowning everybody else. <laughs> the... Not the kids. You can't kill kids. <laughs> He's like, clearly not. You expect my love to exactly. Yes, but uh, when it's done, uh, the Almighty's going to put up a new thing called a rainbow. As a promise not to drown everyone again. But he hasn't even okay. done it yet. That's great. Yeah. Why, Shem? That unicorn's gonna make a run for it. <laughs> yeah, it's too late. <laughs> it's like that's why there are no unicorns why because the other other ran away. That's the best. Uh that's kind of sad because they're all happy about the rain. <coughs> oh. Huh. Yeah. Smirk at the poor bugger, are you? Smirk, me. Well, you're not put him on, though. I'm not consulted on policy decisions, Crawley. Squirming at your feetish. You what is it? So what is it now? Mephistopheles? <laughs> Asmodeus? Crowley? That's the same thing. Instead of Crowley? Maybe? Yeah, that's true. Oh my god. That hurts like a... What was it he said that got everyone so upset? Be kind to each other. Oh. <laughs> That'll do it. Oh my god, bro. But I'm just confused because. Oh no, it's the. A... Oh, AD. I, I read that as 33 BC, and I was very confused on how this was happening. Like now? I was like, um. But he's. Jesus is right there. Like. <laughs> it's AD, not BC. Poor dude. That's gotta hurt like a bitch. Eight years later. What have you got? Give me a jug of whatever you think is drinkable. <laughs> Look at the little he has. Crowley? 
This is gonna be about their whole lives. This is so cool. <laughs> That's true. Salutaria. Sure, salutations as well. In Rome long? Let me tempt you to oh. No, that's <laughs> His face! The best! The Kingdom of Wessex. I don't know much of Europe history. Like, I know it. I know more about France. But I think this is Britain, no? Hello? Yeah, okay. So it's with Alpha. Then the Black Knight is gonna be Crowley, that's for sure. Oh. Right. There you under there, Crowley. Crowley. What the hell are you playing at? It's all right, lad. I know him. He's all right. I'm here spreading ferment. Is that some kind of porridge? No, I'm fermenting <laughs> tranquility. Oh, time. come on, dude. Yeah, I'm I fermenting. Well, I'm meant to be fermenting peace. So we're both working very hard in damp places and just cancelling each other out. Well, you could put it like that. It is a bit damp. Be easy. Uh, possibly, yeah, the result is... <laughs> possibly, yeah. Cancel each other out. But my dear fellow, what would they check? I mean, uh, Michael's a bit of a stickler. You don't want to get Gabriel upset, would you? Oh, I've got a lot of better things to do than verifying compliance reports from us. I want to get yeah. to work. I seem happy enough. As long as you're being seen to be doing something. That's true. Every now and again. No. I love that there, there's like anywhere in the world, and they choose to be both here at the same time. The world is fucking big. <laughs> they look so funny with their armor, and you can see them like their their style as well, changing. And it's funny because. Aziraphale has such a British accent, but Brit, like example, even like at the beginning, but Britain doesn't didn't exist yet, so I think it's hilarious. That's what you said would be inconspicuous here. London among crowds. Well, that was the idea. Hang on, wait there. And this is one of Shakespeare's. The outfits are so. No wonder nobody's here. Pretty gentles. Um, That's Shakespeare. Request a small wasting my time up here. No, no, you're very good. I love all the talking. And what does your friend think? Oh, he's not my friend. We've never met before. We don't know each other. I think you should get on with the play. Uh, yes, uh, Burbage, please. From the top. Of like, don't ask him. He's a demon. I mean, not to be. Come on, Hamlet. Fuck off. I, I heard fuck up. <laughs> no. He doesn't think so. With an old custom stay of his infinite variety. Mm. Yeah, I like that. That's probably another reference that I don't know. Where does he have like a goatee? You're up to good, I take it. What's the good <laughs> No rest for the. Well, good. I have to be in Edinburgh at the end of the week. Oh. I'm meant to be heading to Edinburgh too Welcome this week. Tempting your clan leader to steal some cattle. Doesn't sound like hard work. Hang the spies love and the insolence of office and the spurn that we are. That's why I thought we should be suggesting. What are you suggesting? Or implying, which is that just yeah. one of us goes to Edinburgh and does both. The blessing and the tempting. Well, he's done it. Ooh. Ah. Oh. Now, the arrangement. I don't to say that. They'll destroy you. Oh, he's nice concerned. To Toss you for Edinburgh. Fine, hands. Tales, I'm afraid, you're going to Scotland. It'd take a miracle to get anyone to come and see Hamlet. Ah. <gasps> <laughs> That's yeah, how it worked. I'll do that one my tree. Oh, really? I still prefer the funny ones. I didn't know he could do blessings. I thought it was just like demons did the tenting, angels did the blessing. I mean, is it like a temptation? Is it a curse? 
That is a good question that I don't have the answer to. Paris, 1793. Oh, the revolution? Yeah. Well, if you're dressed like that, of course they're going to f fucking arrest you. They really went far with that shit. Like, they started executing anyone. Oh, huh, he's actually decent. Ah, oh, never mind. Examinons maintenant votre coup. C'est un grand mistake. Uh, Erreur. Ouais. <laughs> I was like, he has actually good accent, and then he said, magnifique. I was like, oh, never, never fucking mind. Pierre, an amateur. Always he let go of the <laughs> tout soon. Bro, seriously? Jean-Claude, who will remove your traitorous head from your... He looks too happy about that. But the first English. Like, yay, so much fun. Now, please. No dreadful mistake discorporating me. Oh, it'll be a complete nightmare. Because he's just not gonna die. Animals. What the deuce are you doing locked up in the Bastille? I thought you were opening a bookshop. Yeah. I was. I got peckish. Peckish. Well, if you must know, it was the crepes. <gasps> That's what you were saying last episode, um, or the one before that. Like this guy crepes, and like the last time I got them were in France in seventeen ninety three. And the brioche. So you just popped across the channel during a revolution because you wanted something to nibble, <laughs> just like that. I have standards. I'd heard they were getting a bit carried away over here, but no, this is not getting carried away. <coughs> this is cutting off lots of people's heads very efficiently with a big head cutting machine. Got a strongly worded note from Gabriel. Well, you're lucky I was in the area. I suppose I am. Why are you here? I mean, a strongly worded us. note. Is he actually going to do anything about that? Like, ending job performance. I suppose I should say thank you for the uh, rescue. Rescue, yeah. Don't say that. If my people here I rescued an angel, I'll be the one in trouble, and my lot do not send rude notes. Well, anyway, yeah. I'm very grateful. What about if I buy you lunch? Oh! <laughs> nice! Dressed like that, he's asking for trouble. <laughs> That's for lunch? What would you say to some creeps? Oh my god, I just realized I haven't seen the intro at all. Huh. But this is fun. I'm liking this. That they like show us kind of their backstories. I've fallen. I didn't really fall. I just, you know. Sauntered vaguely downwards. I need a favor. <laughs> Sounded you vaguely downwards. Crowley, stay out of each other's way. Lend a hand when needed. This is something else. What is so it? If it all goes pear shaped. I like pears. If it all goes wrong. What? I want insurance. What? I wrote it down. Walls have ears. Well, not walls, trees have ears. Ducks have ears. Do ducks have ears? I think so, but I don't see them. Wanted for just insurance. Why does he? I'm not an idiot, Crowley. Do you know what trouble I'd be in if, if they knew I'd been fraternizing? It's completely out of the question. Fraternizing. Well, Why does he want holy idiot. water? Well, and the feeling is mutual, obviously. Oh. <laughs> the marking. What the heck? Oh, is this air raids? World War One? World War Two? Two. The harmony, Mr. Fair. You are late, but not to worry. You have the books for the Führer? Yes, I do. Wait, he's working with the Nazis? What? Books of prophecies. Most definitely he needs it. It has the, the prophecies that are true. The the accurate true prophecies of... of the war. Huh? He's as good as one. The nice and accurate prophecies, prophecies of, of Agatha. Agatha. 
I missed the letter. Sorry. No luck. Prophecy for 1972. Do not buy Beta Max. Who is Peter Max? I have no idea. I would pass it on to the Fuhrer. These volumes well, could he be dead by Berlin then? By the end of the you do not appear worried, my friend. Of course he's not. Ooh, who is that? He's not worried. Who is she? She, my double-dealing Nazi acquaintance, is the reason why none of those books are going back to Berlin. And why your nasty little spy ring will be spending the rest of the war behind bars. Oh, he was framing them. Introduce you. Played for suckers. <laughs> uh, right, everyone, come on, round them up. There's nobody. Rose, where exactly are your people? Royal Anger at a Klein. Oh. Come to us. Du hast den Scheißen von Händler reingelegt. Gut gemacht. Played for a sucker. You must remember that. I am played for a sucker. You are played for a sucker. Crowley, what the fuck? What is that walk? Sorry, consecrated ground. Oh, oh okay. Being a bitch in bad fit. Oh my god. Stopping you getting into trouble. Nazi spies. I was so confused, but because he's in a church. Mr. Anthony J. Crowley, your fame precedes you. Anthony, you don't like it? No, no, I didn't say that. I'll get used to it. In about a minute, a German bomber will release a bomb that will land right here. Will it? Run away, very, very fast. You might not die. You won't enjoy dying. Definitely won't enjoy what comes after. You expect us to believe that? Yeah, I believe him, but yes. and if, uh, in I love that he, it kind of dead. looks like he has to pee. <laughs> He's just dancing around. Oh my god, I'm loving this. And it's like, they had a fight in, and then they just, it, it shows how much he, they care about each other, that he's just like, coming back and he's clearly in pain. Um... <laughs> And he's coming to help him. For my friend and I to survive it. A, a real miracle. Kill them. They're very irritating. Ha! <laughs> In your fucking faces! Uh, can you save the books as well? Well, miracle the way. That worked. That was very kind of you. Shut up. <laughs> it was. No paperwork for us. I that's what I said. Oh, be blown to Aw, oh, that's nice. Miracle of man. <laughs> Lift home. This is the moment when he fell in love. Come on, you can't tell me that's not it, bro. Soho. Safe. So spy. Oh, I was oh, into it. And she'll be going down on the ropes then. I want that. What is that going on? Who are you? I understand you need the locks, man. I was expecting Mr. Narco. Well, Mr. Narco has passed on to his reward. I've taken over the business. He was my cellmate. He taught me everything he knew. This is, looks like and a heist cool. movie. Please. Sit down, Mr. Shadwell. Lance Corporal. And why do you need locksmith? You're literally a demon. You don't mind. Did you raise your hand like you're in fucking school? Stealing from a church? There's no witchcraft involved here. Is there? No. Completely witch free robbery. Ah, uh, there, there probably is. Now, of course, you were not yourself then. <laughs> Just 300? Mr. Crowley, may I have a moment of your time? Striptease. Yes. Lance Corporal Shadwell. What are you a Lance Corporal in? You know, Carl? Yes. Yeah, that was fucking weird. An anonymous organization. Vast. A secret army. The battles of forces of witchery. How nice for you. The okay. witch find their army if you need us. The witch find their army are here for you. What army? Think it over. Is it like the... I mean, I know it's the army of the guy before, but... 
maybe just he's the only one left though so I don't know what happened maybe he's also a bit delusional I don't know oh hey Azurfo caper to rob a church why though no. really it's too dangerous Holy water won't just kill your body, it will destroy you completely. But why do you want holy water? And five years ago. And I haven't changed my mind. But I can't have you risking your life. <gasps> you can call off the robbery. Don't go unscrewing the cap. But why do you want it? Did I did they say it and I just missed it? Because that's it's the real thing. The holiest. Oh my god. But why? I drop you anyway. No, thank you. I don't look so disappointed. Perhaps one day we could, I don't know, go for a picnic. <laughs> Dine at the Ritz. I'll give you a lift anywhere you want to go. You go too fast for me, Crowley. There it is. Gosh, it took thirty minutes to get this shit. <laughs> Don't. So I guess that because of the intro being then, we're gonna go back to the present. But like maybe he said it while he wanted holy water, but I didn't hear him. <laughs> I didn't hear why he would want holy water at all. Right, right number. number. <laughs> I'll, I'll just go to head office and explain it all. Yeah, so, Gabriel, um, listen, Gabriel, at most holy archangel kids, One day. To form, um, Tadfin, and his Just, Gabri I don't think Gabriel will care. On, uh, the end of things. Um, I have his address, and so we just have to eliminate him now. Then everything could still be okay. Yeah. He'll have an enormous hellhound with him. He won't be hard to spot. Enormous hellhound. <laughs> Surprised the huge ginger cat from next door, <laughs> and had attempted to reduce it to cowering jelly by means of the usual glowing stare. Oh! It always worked in the past. <laughs> but the he's just a small dog. A further cat experiment, which would consist of jumping around and yapping excitedly. Oh, she got, She lost a book. Come on, dog. Yeah, yeah. Hello. Are you okay? Can I help? I'm fine. You were crying. And throwing. Hello, this dog. Stupid. Thing. Lost my book now. It's gotta be much. I can help you look for it. Oh, that's sweet. It's been in my family for a long time. I wrote a book once. It was about this pirate who was a famous detective. I bet it was a lot more exciting than any book he hogged backward to the dip and from the old quarry up to the pond. You haven't seen two men in a big black vintage car, have you? Did they steal it? Professional book thieves probably go around in their car stealing. <laughs> no, no, they didn't mean to steal it. Do you want some lemonade? I would, I'm an occultist. Oh, well, that's all right then. <laughs> that's all right then. Come on, you silly dog. There had been a horseshoe over the door of Jasmine Cottage for hundreds of years. It protected the inhabitants from evil, or so they. Oh my god, you're still here? Bruh. Oh no, I'll me ward you off with a bell. <laughs> Dusty old- Oh, is that the guy's hat? Or your ancestor's hat? Like, hey, that's my fucking name! <laughs> Strictly speaking, Shadwell doesn't run the Witchfinder army. No. According to Shadwell's pay ledgers, it is run by Witchfinder General Smith. Saucepan, tin, milk bottle, deceased, and cupboard. Because Shadwell's limited imagination had been beginning to struggle at yeah. this point. Oh no, it was just random imaginary people. Ah, that's kind of really sad. Well, clean living. They know each other? Uh, your father? Uh, how is he? Oh wait! Is it the same guy from before? Yeah, he's well. They've uh, prepared the ledger. I thought it was just a guy. Your Honor, it's a field in Oxfordshire. Send your best people down there. I'm looking for a boy. He's about eleven. So he told them. Okay. Suspicious. Oh, okay. 
that that works as well. This uh, boy is a witch. Possibly. No. We'll have to find him first, won't we? Right. So wait, we'll his whole team is this is. guy. And they are discolored force field surrounding someone. Everyone's got one. And I can look at its strengths and color and tell you how you're feeling. Well, that's, that's brilliant. Okay. Why don't they teach us about them at school? Because school is a repressive tool of the state. So what color is okay. my own? Okay. Oh, do you actually see it? Nothing. Maybe it's because he hasn't got it to his full powers yet? I can't keep him. Did they teach that in school, don't though? Don't started on global And that's because whales have huge brains and they're hunting them for no reason. Oh, nuclear power stations. It's nuclear power stations are rubbish. Yes. Yes, they are. We went to a normal school trip, and yeah. there was nothing bubbling, and there wasn't any green smoke, and there wasn't anyone in there. <laughs> Just stereotypes. So right. If you're interested in any of this, at least you didn't seem disappointed. Answer. You don't have to read them if you don't want. Wicked. Doom, 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 doom. Atlantis. Fact from fiction. You can't see America. Wait, is he emanating this whole force field? Is there a fail? Got your message. That's so big. cool. Lay it on. It's like his whole aura is just okay. the whole thing. What side are currently transporting him to the plains of Megiddo? Apparently that's the traditional starting point. Middle Eastern unrest, everything else just follows. The four horsemen yep. ride right out. That's the thing. Battle between heaven and hell. Yes. Well, um, it's possible that the demon Crowley, uh, 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 Wily adversary, <laughs> keeps me on my toes, I can tell you, uh, Antichrist, might be, um... In England. <laughs> somewhere else? Where agents? I would love to see his team. Team who, who would investigate the possibility. Um, Why... Would he tell him? Hypothetically speaking, if that were the case, it wouldn't change anything, as you fail. There was war in heaven long before the earth was created. Uh huh. Crowley and the rest were cast out, but nothing was ever really settled. Things to do. Yeah, they're bitches. That's what I thought. They're the bitches. Earth isn't going to just end itself, you know. No. Yes. Right. Sucky. Heavens, such a. Oh, she really can see it. Cause, I just thought she had a book. Oh, they have like the same aura of the couple. Everybody's so friendly. I couldn't help but notice, young person, that you have a map. Casing the giant, are we? I'm, I'm renting Jasmine Cottage. Oh, good lord, you're an American tourist. Sorry, thought you were a person of interest. Oh, I, I am. Listen, 11 years ago, something came to this village, some sort of uh, beast or creature. And if your neighborhood watch... Would you go elsewhere? Like, back to America? Wow, it's so brute. Fatty's proliferate. In Oxford's higher Oxfordshire village. Again. Hello. Which friend is Sergeant Shadwell, please? Or um one of his officers? Agent in Devon to see if he is available. No doubt. Did you know who? Who? Me? Your um sponsor. Listen. Do you have any men? I need them to poke about a bit. Poke? Where exactly do you want them poking? Where he is at all times. They're I can give both you with him. I'll put a squad of my best men onto it. Oh, good. Thank you so much. The one I should have asked about, which find the major blue bottle. I was so sorry to hear of his untimely end. I sent flowers. I the flowers were appreciated. And so was the extra 20 pounds for the They're both store. being conned. And next week, if they pick up Oh my god. Views, Squad of best men to tap for your dear fellow. And uh, <laughs> until I give you more orders. Now, the boy is called Adam. Adam Young and his address is number four Hogback Lane. I 
found something really interesting. Hmm. I've discovered some unusual weather patterns. There's a town in Oxfordshire with some very strange weather events. Oh, rain and blood, or rain and fish. Catsfield. In summer, withering the crops after some hag got into an argument with a farmer. No, it's just, it always has to dream of as a kid. It snowed there every Christmas Eve for the last 11 years. Not oh, wow. interested. Just look for witches and witches. He's right. He's doing that. He's using his powers to just have good weather and stuff. Do I? He loves hunger. Uh. He loves people not eating enough in fancy restaurants. Your main course, madam? Chicken froth on a reduction of broccoli gel with a mushroom. Oh my god, that's so small. He's a businessman with a chain of restaurants. What the fuck? And he's about to launch something new. Chow. Food free food. Artificial bun, artificial pickle. The shake doesn't contain any actual food content either. Well, nobody shakes contain any actual but food. But why? Content. I mean, okay. why would anybody Let's buy that? Like, why would anybody be like, hell yeah? You know what I mean? That girl should rap, man. <gasps> it's a delivery man! Hi. I thought it was you. Looked around, I thought, tall gent with a beard, nice suit. There's a package for you, sir. I thought for sh. Who knows? Cancel all my appointments. For how long? The foreseeable future. I thought they just spawned in the middle of nowhere. I didn't think they were like existing and living, but I, <laughs> I thought they just like example the apocalypse and then Minecraft sound Bloop, appear. And they be called Hadfield, what a <laughs> Hadfield. <laughs> My bad. Right. Well, I suppose it can't do any harm. I can't believe they're, they're be still both being conned. Before you leave, what for? Your armor of righteousness. The bandstand. <laughs> Dumbass, that's what he's saying. Dad, do you know that there are ley lines everywhere? Uh, no, Adam, ley lines are rubbish. Oh, you'll like this bit, Deirdre. They've taped the gun under the chair. No, it's not rubbish. They wouldn't write about it in magazines if it was rubbish. <laughs> uh, sadly, they would, yeah. Oh, no. If he's going to start believing that, he's going to start making it come true. Right? Is that what's gonna happen? Do you think he's alright? He's fine. I don't know about that, bro. Well, have you found the missing Antichrist name, address, and shoe size yet? <laughs> why, why would I have a shoe size? It's a joke. I don't know either. It's, it's the great plan, Crowley. Yeah. For the record, great. You were an angel once. That was a long time ago. I would love to see him as an angel. We find the boy. My agents can do it. And then what? We eliminate him? Someone does. I'm not personally out for killing kids. You're the demon. I'm the nice one. I don't have to kill children. Uh -huh. If you kill him, then the world gets a reprieve and heaven will not have blood on its hands. Uh yeah, why are you so... I'm not Maybe because he's scared. ...killing anybody. This is ridiculous. You are ridiculous. I don't even know why I'm still talking to you. Well, frankly, neither do I. Enough. I'm leaving. You can't leave, Crowley. There isn't anywhere to go. It's a big universe. Either they... We're not friends. We are an angel and a demon. Oh, come on, nothing bro. Whatsoever in common. I don't even like you. You do. Even if I did know where the Antichrist was, I wouldn't tell you we're on opposite sides. We're on our side. There is no our side, Crowley. Not anymore. Well, that was nice. So fucking nice. Gosh. Why? I'm just saying why. I didn't honestly think he would be that interested, but go for, good for him. I would be so scared of letting stuff on my bed. Why are people whispering in my ears? Wait. Did he get rid of the n nuclear power? 
Is this a joke? 240 megawatts of power are currently being produced by this power station. It's just, according to our indicators, nothing's producing them. What the hell? What do you mean I have to authorize it? Is there anyone else? Well, he wanted hazmat suits. Here are hazmat suits. What? Enormous room without a nuclear reactor in it. Oh my god, nothing. Oh. It's just gone. Oh, okay, how did you see that from up there? I call bullshit. Is is one of these things a nuclear thing? Because and how that you you have so much power. That's so scary. Well, that was a nice episode. Um, the number of technical difficulties I had was insane. But you won't see it. <laughs> Hopefully, you'll see some lagging. A bit. <sighs> Seriously, I think Prime Video and o my OBS hate each other. Seriously, it's the worst. Anyways, I had such a, go a good time. Uh, this was a really nice episode. We get to see more of Adam's powers and what he can do. Um, I... I was not quite fond of the fight, especially as we got their whole backstory, and it was just, like, fun. And, like, learning about them and seeing how sweet they are and how sweet they were. And then there's just a fight over something. Like, why did they, why did Aziraphale even fight? I think maybe he's frustrated because of what happening in heaven, and he's just, like, taking it out on Crowley a little bit, um, which sucks. But, god damn, I was not expecting that fight. I hope they make up soon, because they have three episodes to do so, um, before, yeah. And I realized that I'm gonna be in, like, in, in September, I'm gonna be watching four shows at the same time, with school, with, with school, it's gonna be interesting. <laughs> Um, but yeah. So, oops, sorry. Yeah. I don't really have anything else to say, I don't think. I mean, yeah, of course I do. Um, I love that he was super interested in Lane. I thought for sure he would mock her, kind of. Just, not like, in a mean and like, wanting to be mean way. But more of a, just like, he's not interested and he thinks it's for nerds or stuff. Or something. I don't know. Um, because of the <laughs> way he was like... With his friends and they were like, you know, chasing witches and like... Tor torturing them. I mean, I didn't think he was evil, but I didn't think he would just take it in stride, you know what I mean? Because of the game. But... Surprised that no. And like, it's a good thing that the nuclear power is gone, but at the same time, not really. <laughs> it's like, it's a good thing, yeah, but that nuclear power was powering a lot of shit, and now it's gone. So it's, it's more like, it would have been fun if it would be gradual, but it wasn't. <laughs> so it's like, okay. So that's gonna cause a lot of fuckery. And I love the idea that he's been using his... I, I wouldn't say using his powers, but like, I'm gonna say that for now, but like, to literally have the perfect weather all the time. Like, like he said, the weather that you would want to have, that you dreamed of, dreamed of as a kid. So, that's the best. <laughs> that's the best. Um, and it's like... A thing that doesn't, you don't really notice it, right? It's like, it's the weather. <laughs> I mean, and it's perfect. If the weather was like fucked up and there was like hurricanes every year, I mean, in that part of England that doesn't really get hurricanes, is what I mean. That would be worrying and people would get more into it, but somebody's having perfect weather is not really something that you're like, ah, the Antichrist! <laughs> You know what I mean? Um, so yeah. Seriously, I'm having a ton of fun with this show. Can't wait for season 2 already, even though I'm not even done with season 1. 
so yeah i hope you guys liked the video if you didn't don't, don't be afraid to leave a like comment what you thought below subscribe to see more and check out my patreon for incoming reactions and i'll see you later ciao